We're here live at uh, 20 minutes after 7. The tugboat has just brought my black people ashore. And it's going to be interesting. I got to watch this because the legacy, they're trying to come ashore on the side of legacy. So, all this is some interesting stuff. Um, that means they have to walk over the legacy onto this boat and somebody could get hurt tonight but nonetheless I'm gonna try to bring this to you as best I can going on these people's boat this is the legacy she ain't leaving till 8 o'clock and she ain't moving so we're gonna try to bring Here's the tugboat. This is a catastrophe tonight. Here's the tugboat. And they are. Uh, this is this is this is interesting right here. All kind of action here tonight on Abaco and your live with TV time remaining. The legacy is here. Uh, the the Bobingi. It's made, there goes the tugboat, he's gone. He did his job, now they're floating at the mercy of the ropes. The ropes, the tugboat is gone and they're drifting into the legacy with hundreds of workers trying to get off this boat. And I am here live, live, live with these legacy boys trying to help their comrades that are drifting. And here they are. Kai here, and here they are, all of them trying to get off. And you are live with WCAY, where the migrants are coming ashore. Welcome to Abaco. And that's what you want. They just want air condition and Wi-Fi. Got them in this condition. Look here. This one here, I'm going to run into this. Watch it. Bing. That's a hole right there. Uh, I am here on top of all of this catastrophe while this boat is still going ahead. It's still going ahead. Nothing, they have no power. They are the mercy of the ropes. And this ain't going to work tonight. Because I'm a captain too and I know this stuff ain't going to work. So here we are. This rope is the only rope that is holding this big boat with all these workers that are being out there hungry. I just want to know who's going to pay these guys. And this guy want to get off. <laughs> These guys here fooling around. They want to get off this ship. And here they are, jumping off. And the boat is not done. Please wait, please wait. Please wait. This ain't gonna get tired of tonight. Let the boat get tired of. Safety first. Let the boat get tired of. And here we got the Bahama Fox Ferry boy. This is a dangerous event right here. These guys have been out there like refugees for hours. And this can't get tied up like this, but but uh, we have the Bahamas Fast Ferry and the Legacy trying to link. And I just happen to be in the middle of this. I, I just happen to be on the sweet spot. But it's good to see that my brothers are Shaw. And trust me, these brothers want to get off of this floating castle that they're floating. And one rope is holding it. And there's no power. The tugboat is gone, and these guys are just drifting backwards. They just drift into the Haitian sloop, and now they're coming backwards. I'm just trying to give you play by play. We got one rope on, and we got hundreds of workers right here, up and down. They wanted this ferry because they got air conditioning, and they got by five. <laughs> but they ain't got no engine. And uh, Bahamas Fast Ferry fella, he's working good. And you are here live on WCAY. WCAY is right in the middle of all this action, action, action. It's just like the uh, WWF. And this boat is drifting backwards, uncontrollable, no engine, with hundreds of people. And these brothers are working tonight. This is separates the captains from the non captains. So now we got two ropes. We're getting closer. We're four minutes into this, four minutes into the trying to dock this, and I wonder what they're gonna do if the legacy wasn't at the help. 
if the legacy crew weren't here to assist, what would happen with this floating boat with all these people on it? Everybody, that's my good friend right there. Boy, you're back, you're on another boat. <laughs> and we're alive, live, live, as this boat try to come together with no engine. Watch this. Coming to shore with no engine and these guys want to get off. I wonder if they got life best for everybody here. And here we are, finally close to docking, but they're still trying to figure this out. Uh, the tug is back there. Kai is here. Uh, the workers are here. They're all the way up here. They got plenty of light on it. I don't know why they got no engine. This boy getting anchor on it. Y'all can't drop anchor, y'all rookie captains. And the Bengi has finally almost docked. They ain't docked yet. They're still trying to pull ashore. And the legacy have to leave at 8 o'clock. So I know this could wait. That means they mess up the legacy schedule because the legacy has to take off at 8 o'clock. And they are side the legacy with 100 plus people on it. So that ain't gonna work. You're here live. High recording. And nobody can get off yet because we have that gap in between there. But uh, these workers want to get off. It's another uh, six, seven minutes and the first set of workers start to get off. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, that is what's happening here in the Marshall Harbor Port where 20 million dollars worth of boats and contract has been drifting with my Abaco people on it and they have just now come ashore. The only reporter that got this story live on WCAY where the workers are finally coming off. And I don't know how they're gonna work this if there were girls on board there because these guys, there's no plank here for the ladies to come off. There's some lady, there's a lady there, but she cannot jump off like how these guys are jumping off here. Oh, she jumped off. That's a talk, that's a, that's a, that's a, she jumped off like a man just now. Something wrong with that. You know what happened in Vegas Bay, but here you got all the workers at 7.55, uh, just now, Bahama Fast Ferry has finally landed in Abaco. And here they are, jumping off. That, that is so dangerous because how they're jumping off there could be a final jump. Live at the dock. Kai Mills reporting. W C A. Why? And these guys are happy to be ashore.